Welcome to Christ Mystery Church on Sunday, March 22nd. We gather today online uh, until you reach us through our website. It's an opportunity for you to find a few of the texts that are being used throughout the worship service. Uh, and you can also click on those opportunities for you to hear music or scripture or prayer or the sermon. We wish we could meet together in our sanctuary or in our chapel, but given the current situation with the coronavirus, we know that it's much more important for us to seek the health of individuals in our community and not invite people into our community that might spread coronavirus as well. So we hoped to meet last week, uh, had everything all prepared, looking at spe special places that we would have for people to sit, uh, and then decided on Saturday that it was just too much of a risk, and so we canceled our service. Our session met on Tuesday night, and we've now decided that we will cancel all our services here at the church until the first week of May. But we will be online, and so uh, we as a staff and other members of the church will continue to be actively involved in providing worship opportunities for you and educational opportunities for you. Uh, you can turn in to our Zoom site on Wednesdays and uh, have a discussion with Lady and myself, uh, taking a look at the Bible and theology. A variety of other ways that our youth are staying connected, uh, children are staying connected. Our hope is that we can find ways that we can see each other and care for each other, be that through a Zoom site, uh, be that through sharing time on Facebook, uh, be that an opportunity for us to call each other, to write to each other, to let people know in our community that we care. Most importantly, may this be a time for us to pray for each other so that we can be healthy. And those individuals that are going through experiences of the virus in their life right now, may this be a time for them to find healing and wholeness. Be with all those that have lost lives at this point. Let us show our care and concern for them. And so as we gather now to pray to God, to celebrate God's presence in our lives, let us trust in a God that promises to be with us and care for us. Amen.